everyone, as part of the Gumshoe Witch Queen title, you need to get the No Peeking Triumph, which requires you to find 10 hidden darkness rifts all around the throne world. Now, these are not only hidden, but you also need the Parasite Grenade Launcher in order to damage them. The first one is going to be over here in the Fluorescent Canal. What you need to do is locate these rifts, damage yourself with the Parasite Grenade Launcher, and then you will be able to damage it. The second one is going to be kind of on this bridge. You just kind of go through the fluorescent canal, go through the giant doors, and you'll be able to get here. You'll need a sniper to see this one at the very end of the bridge and a long range weapon to hit it, but you should be able to get it quite easily. The third one is within the Sepulchre Lost Sector in the Fluorescent Canal. There's actually two here. One requires you to complete the Lost Sector, then to the left of the chest you'll find it tucked away in the corner of the room, and then the other one requires you to go within the Remembrance activity. It's kind of hard to explain, but that's also located in this Lost Sector. You do the Deep Sight, you align the symbol, it spawns the portal. This will take you through the Altar of Reflection activity, make your way all the way to the end, and in the final room you will find the darkness portal kind of sitting there then you're gonna head to the top of the map towards queen's bailey off to the left side you're gonna find the next darkness portal then you're gonna make your way to the miasma location at the top of the map uh where on the left side of this you're gonna find kind of a darkness gate looking structure off to the right of this area you're gonna find the next darkness portal Once you find this one, you're gonna head within the Metamorphosis uh, Lost Sector, complete it. At the end, there's gonna be this launch pad. And during this little section where you launch, there's gonna be one kind of stuck halfway in between. You're gonna have to think pretty quickly here in order to get that one. Then you're gonna head back to the Quagmire location. The first one is going to be within the Extraction Lost Sector. Just complete the Lost Sector and right as you complete the Lost Sector, you're gonna find across from the chest, you'll see the first Darkness Portal, which you can destroy there. Then you're gonna head to the top right of the Quagmire location. There's gonna be some castle structures as you make your way to Alluring Curtain. In one of these structures, you will find the next Darkness Portal. This next one is the 10th and final one, and it can be quite difficult to find. You're gonna make your way all the way down to the Temple of Wrath. Follow the location that I do here. Then after that incredibly long trek, you'll find yourself in this hellscape area. Traverse the bridge, go all the way to the end. On the right, you'll see a pathway with a swinging lantern. And when you stand on the rock that I am, you'll be able to see the last darkness portal kind of on a rock up to your right. So I hope you guys found this useful. If you did, make sure to leave a like rating and to share it with your friends. If you're interested in watching either of the two videos on screen, you can click their respective annotations to be taken to them. If you're brand new to my channel, make sure to the giant version of my logo on screen to be subscribed to more awesome Destiny 2 videos and live streams. Thank you guys so much for watching today, and I'll see you in my next video.